Monica. Um, like you said, I am the product evangelist for Clever Tech. So thank you all for having us and SP New Tech. Um, we're very excited to be here and to give you more information about what we do and who we are as a company. Um, the company was founded in India a couple of years ago. Um, we most recently launched uh, worldwide and so we are you know out there evangelizing or I am out there with a team evangelizing the product and letting people know who we are. Um, we are a mobile app platform so how many people here have mobile apps or develop mobile apps or market mobile apps or maybe fund mobile app companies? <laughs> awesome. So um, we provide um, the back-end analytics and engagement tools for mobile apps um, whether you're in gaming or e-commerce, um, we provide all the analytics and infrastructure that you can see and support and understand about your users and the behaviors that they're taking within your apps. So you can think of us as like a Google Analytics but drill down to actual personal profiles um, and then engagement. So why did we get into this um, journey? Um, we realized that there was um, a ton of different data. People were um, originally kind of focused on acquisition and acquiring users. And as you know, you know, mobile apps are growing exponentially. Um, and I think by next year, there'll be about 2 billion smartphones on the market. So those are huge numbers. And that's only growing and growing and growing. Um, on average, people spend about 40 minutes a day um, using these apps. And they have about 36 apps on their smartphone. So we know that people are downloading apps. They're engaging. They're using apps, but not necessarily engaging. So. Um, one of the things that we're helping companies do is to provide a retention strategy, an engagement strategy, to make their apps more effective and more sticky so that they can use them, oh, there we go, um, so that they use them more frequently and that you're targeting your users and giving them the right messages at the right time, so relevancy and frequency along with time. So we've, um, I didn't build the product, but I, I like to think that uh, I helped um, evangelize it, but the product is um, definitely secure and stable and scalable. So whether you're a first-time app entrepreneur or you have um, some of our customers have about 25 million um, uh, users, uh, active users, 10 million active users, um, we scale up or down. So we work with all different types of companies, and we do about we track about 2.5 billion um, events now, and we have about 150 million um, users using the system. So. Um, what you're seeing right here, I'll kind of jump into the dashboard, is um, active users. So you'll see total active users, engaged users, and users by platform. And then if you scroll down, um, you can take a look at some of the events that the, we're tracking within this demo uh, account. So right here, this is an e-commerce demo account, so you'll see things like added to cart, app launched, charged, and then you can see an activity stream down to the user. So what are your users actually doing within these apps? So if I move over to the activity stream, oh, sorry, quick view here. Um, you can see things like users by platform and then um, some dashboards about your trends and activities daily, weekly, monthly, and today, and new and existing users. Um, and then if you scroll over to the mobile app, You can see things like daily active user count, weekly active user, monthly active users. This is all real time, so this is aggregating all the users within your app. And then you can see um, by version, and then you can see some of your engagement metrics. So retention and engagement are at the bottom of the screen here, and we track all of this. So we have an SDK that you can compile in your app, and it'll start recording user behavior within your app. Um, another thing that we do uh, very nicely is we track uninstalls. So you can see an uninstall dashboard and see who is deleting your apps. Um, maybe they're on a wrong version or you've just released a new feature. So you can actually retarget those users that have uninstalled your app through email notifications within the system as well. So we do um, do email push notifications and an app notifications to constantly um, enable you to engage with those users in app. So it'll show you how many um, engaged and non-engaged users you have, your net activations, total installs, and new activations. And then we have also have a revenue dashboard that'll take you through. Um, sorry, that'll take you through your daily uh, revenue and app if you do have um, if you do have uh, things that you're charging with an app. So I have one minute, so I'm going to scroll down here. Um, we do have a lot of user analytics, so we can. 
Um, we can record all the user actions so you can see um, and filter by event mm -hmm. properties, who charged within your app, um, view details about who charged, who added to cart, abandoned cart. Um, you can see things like frequency, time of day um, that people are actually buying within app. So a lot of really good analytics and data that you get on your user behavior. And then you can see um, sample people who charge. We have regional um, information about who's buying and when, trend properties, technographics, geography. So there's a lot of different data that you can get in here on analytics and what your users are doing. Um, and the one thing that we actually do that's, that's completely different from, from anyone else is we've actually introduced um, what we call clever campaigns. And clever campaigns are a way to, right out of the box, welcome first-time users, remind users, um, a, a, a reminder to new users. Um, we've created custom templates to help with this. So you can think of these as like in-app marketing templates that you can use to send automated push notifications or automated emails to your users. So this really um, helps with retention rates out of the box. There's a couple lines of code that you can add. You don't have to be a developer to use this. Um, and what you can do is start engaging. So we have six different uh, Clever campaigns that we've built. And it's really nice. You can just go in, um, edit the content. Um, and here's uh, an in-app notification where you can just quickly edit it and send. And here's um, a welcome push notification that'll show you, um, you know, a pre-built template that we've built, but you can add in your own custom information. So what we've seen with our customers to date is that they've increased their retention and engagement by like 50%, upwards of 200%. So um, they're able to really increase the stickiness of their app and provide very targeted messages to their users at the right time. Um, we found that over 90%, or I think the statistics um, are about over 90% of people uninstall within the first 70 or seven days or become inactive users. So this really helps with um, retaining those users from day one. So whether you're a startup app company or you're working with app companies or you're a developer or a marketer, we can get you started very quickly out of the box. So I think I'm out of time here. Sorry to go so quickly, but um, we do have a sign up on our um, homepage on clever.com clevertap.com. You can sign up and then we'll give you access to the demo fairy store, what you're seeing right here, which has um, demo data for an e-commerce store, but we'd be more than happy to talk to you about um, how to increase retention in your apps. All right, let's open it up to questions. Any questions? Uh, maybe I'll start us off. Um, sounds like uh, some of the functionality is reminiscent of uh, marketing automation or email marketing platform, but specifically for mobile. Mm -hmm. Is that how you guys perceive the company and the value proposition? Uh, you know, we're actually, the, the way that we're headed, the direction that we're headed is, is really personalizing your app. So personalization, it, it, there is a component of that. Um, so, you know, like the marketing automation, the, the Eloquas, the Marketos, the, the big marketing automation software, you know, we're kind of pulling some of that marketing automation within app. Um, but we also have an API where we can deliver highly relevant um, experiences. So for Monica, if I'm living in San Francisco as a woman, I might be delivered a different app experience than you as a man, Eugene, working for SV New Tech. So we can actually, with those event properties, um, work with you to provide those customized experiences that make it a more relevant experience for the customer and the end user. So that's kind of where we see ourselves in the marketplace. Yes? Um, can you provide individualized data for, in essence, building a dashboard for a customer via what you can see here? So let's say I have a customer that uses my application and they have a dashboard which we built for them, but can this data be pulled and shown for them? Yeah, great question. Yeah, so the question was, um, can you pull the data and create your own custom dashboards? Is yeah, that right? For, like, let's say a client, I have a client on the application who has their own store. Yeah. And they have their own dashboard where they can manage everything. Is this data data that will keep it centralized? We would to individualize it out to, like, let's say 10 different clients? Yeah, we do work with um, a number of different um, developer shops, too, who are, are building multiple apps. So there are a bunch of different things you can do. You can pull the data out. We have an API that you can pull it out and, and provide it your own custom dashboard. So if that's something that you want to serve up to your customers, that capability is there. Um, and then we also have the ability to, if you have multiple apps, 
and um, you want to have a centralized view of all of those users, um, we also have that capability yeah. too. So if you're, you know, building a ton of different apps, um, we can we can work with you to, to have those custom dashboards built. Any other questions? I saw one. Yes. Yeah. Is your tool can work with non-native applications? For example, can I connect it to my phone gap application? Phone gap application. I am Just not. Just for instance. Yes, I think yes, you can. Yeah, for any platform. Yes. Will it, and it will work <coughs> the same. Yes. Okay. Are you using? What are you using? Like Cordova? Actually, yeah, phone gap Cordova yeah. and uh, a bunch of frameworks inside. Yeah. So mostly JavaScript framework. Yes. Okay.